Vasily is a director of one of the leading private equity firms, Greek, London, fascinating new friend and colleague of mine. Um, I've been really in intrigued with some of the, I've learned more about, I think, the banking system in general from my conversations with Vasily, please. Thank you. Um, so I think that the question that Julie sent across is who is going to win the next decade. Um, I, I, I struggle with Greece and the UK, but um, both have their own sets of challenges. But uh, what I see, um, uh, and when we try to analyze and speak to clients about um, where to allocate capital and, and uh, what we think are the winning strategies is look at who has been winning over the last few years, and then you need to guess whether this trend is going to continue or change. So capital has been winning in the last few years um, because of ultra low, a decade of ultra low interest rates. Well, that decade is over, uh, clearly. And <clears throat> the COVID was just one of um, the reasons this happened. There are other reasons which are geopolitical that uh, have precipitated this. And we Greeks being here in the Yacht Club, a lot of the Greek ship owners see the global supply chains kind of unraveling in, in, or changing at least in different ways. And that creates opportunities in itself for capital, but also creates new opportunities for labor as well. So there's a lot of reshoring. Um, <clears throat> Europe needs to get its act together and get onto that trend uh, any way they can, because the, the US is doing that. Uh, with Mexico and, and, and also within the US in critical sectors. I think um, so whoever wins is the one that effectively achieves political stability. You will have seen that Greece went through a lot of political stability. Now everybody is quite positive about Greece because we have regained political stability. The US used to have political stability. It has been rocky over the last few years. If, if they manage, as I think they will, to, uh, to crack the nut of the US middle class and give them kind of a piece of the action of the last 10 years, I think they're gonna do well. I think Europe is gonna struggle as Greece struggled over the last 10 years. The UK has its own political instability. Last, December, last September, uh, it, it, it was proof that you can actually rock a G7 economy in six weeks. Uh, and so political stability, whoever has the, the right political system will uh, actually be winning in the next few years. And politi politics is something we Greeks know well, but it's quite unpredictable in some ways. And uh, so we keep an eye on that. Thank you very much.